My name is Josie Lemon Allen. I'm the executive director at Bridge the Gap Coalition. July Perry was a lot of things. Um, he was a businessman. He was a family man. He was a community. Um, he was a community organizer. Um, he was a black business owner that lived in Okoe during 1920. He was the one when people came into Orlando looking for work, looking for housing and opportunity, they went to July Perry. We do have evidence of there being a stir with the, with the KKK rally that week before discouraging people to vote in that election year. Um, and as he's organizing people to vote, um, you know, things turn south very quickly in Okoe. Most Norman goes to cast his vote, he's turned away. He goes to July Perry and they kind of meet and say, okay, well, let's go down to Judge Cheney's home, which is here in Orange County. Judge Cheney sends them back into Okoe and says, you know, take down the names of the people that aren't allowing you to vote. Um, and very quickly it escalated at the polls. At the same time, they, the word had gotten out that the blacks were trying to vote and this kind of preemptive um, event um, of the Klan and other um, officials to, to shut this vote down, it, it, it was sparked in Okoe. Um, the sheriff goes to July Perry's home um, and as he steps out to speak to the sheriff's, um, the daughter on the inside fires a gun out of the house. And this is when the shootout begins. Well, in the hours that follow, um, Okoe is burned to the, to the ground. The Masonic Lodge, the church, the schools, the homes, even the blacks in the North Quarters that weren't, I won't say as involved or active, you know, it was that they were clearing the entire town that night. So someone could be sitting in their home and while this is breaking out in the South Quarters, now they're being run out as well, being burned out of their homes um, and unfortunately murdered during the night. We knew that we wanted to memorialize July Perry and also the descendants of Okoe. We need these symbols to remind us so that July Perry and the other people that died that night and the other people that lost their homes and the tragedies that took place didn't happen in vain.